Hey guys, this is uh, Kodraco, and uh, a lot of you guys have been, for a while now, have been requesting a tutorial on how, on some of my backgrounds that are like really, really high quality. And uh, there's already tutorials of this on YouTube, but uh, yeah, I mean, as many times as I refer, the tu like, refer those tutorials to other people, I still get that question a lot, so I thought was, I might, just, might as well make that video. So alright, here I got a background that I made. And it's uh, it's all right, and just a uh, background for one shot, one kill gaming. And yeah, so one thing about why some some of my backgrounds, if you look, they uh, the quality is really bad, is because uh, like uh, I put like I use like flares, some, some not on all my backgrounds, but a lot of my backgrounds I use like a lot of flares, and that adds um, like a lot of memory, or you know memory usage or whatever. Just I don't know how to explain it, but it like adds a lot to it. So uh, I can't save it as high quality as I want, but here's basically how you save it, high quality. So uh, if you have a nice looking background and there's not too much on it, you can usually um, do this. All right, so you got the background image or whatever, and uh, YouTube, it says uh, it's like 256 kil kilobytes maximum, and that's a complete lie. It's just I don't, do not understand why they said that because it's not true at all. But all right, so let's go to file, save for weapon devices. And that's what you have to do to file safe weapon devices in here. You'll, you'll usually end up, it takes a little bit to open up, but you'll usually end up on, uh, not GIF, JPEG, right? And then uh, right here, you know, you can see the preview. And what you want to look is right here. It says 548. Now click this and go down to PNG 24. And wait for it to load, it says 986.6K. As long as it's under 1000K, 1000k so if it's 1001k it probably it, i mean i've never tried i've never gotten like anything over 1000k because it's so close to mb it usually just goes straight to there but if it's under 1000k then you can use it so it can't be any uh mb it has to be under 1000k i've said that like 12 times already but it has to be under 1000k <laughs> and then you can uh save it in png format and that gives as you can see gives a really nice crisp high quality image and it looks really nice but uh most of my backgrounds a lot of time it'll add um maybe if i just i don't know sometimes i'll have like textures and just let's, let's check up all these because see if you can see here let me just show you again what i just did i had a uh, back when i first tried to save this as a png it was 1000 oh it was 1. like 0 10 uh, mb so i had to get rid of some stuff so the original image looked like this all right, as you can see, but the final image actually looked like this because I had to get rid of some stuff like textures a lot will um, add a, a lot because it's just different like, you know, just textures. This one added a lot. I don't even know why it's not even that much, but this one added a good amount. Actually, this one added a lot for some reason. And then this I just took off just for a little bit more and it got straight down to under 1,000. So, uh, but let's imagine that I got all these on. Go to file, save for weapon devices, and I go to PNG, and you can see that if uh, you can see in a second, uh, yeah, you can see, uh, yeah, all right, you can see right here, 1.377m. So that's too much, and you can't use you, that's too much memory, and YouTube won't accept it. But YouTube will accept anything under 1,000k. So. If it's too much and you really don't want to take the time getting rid of stuff, you can just go to File, Save As, and the best way to save it for uh, something that you can't save as a PNG, you just go to Save, and then, okay, I just saved it as a Photoshop document, but you go to Save As, Format, JPEG, and then um, on JPEG Options, just go to Quality 12, Baseline Standard, and if it's already, if, it's, if your background has so much stuff in it, it's too much, uh, don't automatically go down to 11 because 11 is pretty bad quality. It's go to baseline optimized. If that's too much, go to baseline progressive. And if that's still too much, which I doubt, just go to 12, 11. But yeah, that's how you uh, save your my backgrounds high quality. Also with avatars, you can save um, you can save all of them as PNG 24. Avatars are basically the little YouTube logos or icons. You can save all of them as PNG 24s. Because, uh, I, I mean, I don't know if all of them, but I've never, ever had a qual like a maximum memory problem with icons. So I appreciate you can save them as high quality as you can. But, yeah, thanks, guys, for watching. And, uh, yeah.